Hi all, I thought I'd do a short video just showing you some of the things that worked for me um, to hide a baby bump in the office. So, um, the very worst thing you can do is tuck a top into a pencil skirt. Um, if you have to do that though, there are some other accessories you can add. Um, you can add something like a scarf, which hides the bump when you stand to the side. Um, that works if you have a really cold office. Most offices usually are. You can also add a jacket over the top and keep it on. Again, that just disguises it when you stand to the side. If your bump's bigger, you can also try a scarf and a jacket to hide the area entirely. Um, but if your office isn't very cold, that's probably not going to fly. <laughs> best thing you can do with a top and a pencil skirt is actually, instead of having it tucked in, have it tucked out. Um, it looks a lot more casual this way though, so if you're in a very corporate office you probably won't get away with it, but a printed top just kind of sort of disguises the belly quite well when you leave it untucked. Button down shirts are a good option. They look a little bit more formal when you leave them untucked and they can still cover the bump quite well. Um, you might have to size up in your usual shirt. Um, as the bump grows, it might start getting a bit tight, so you might need another size up, um, but that works really well. Another option, if you can't um, get away with leaving a top untucked, is to actually only partially tuck it in. From the side, the, if it's a really drapey top, it'll actually hide the baby belly quite well. Just that extra little drape. Um, and again, with the jacket over the top, it looks almost like it's entirely tucked in, but you're just disguising the protruding belly with people thinking it's the protruding top instead. <laughs> one thing that works really well for Casual Friday, if you have one, um, is an Empire Waist top with skinny jeans. Um, I wouldn't recommend trying this with a pencil skirt, it, it's a bit of an odd silhouette and you might actually get people coming up and asking if you're pregnant, but when you pair it with skinny jeans you can't actually tell that it's a bump and not just the blowing out of the top, so this works really well for casual Fridays. This last way is probably my favourite way um, and I relied on it quite a lot during my pregnancies. So it's just to use a fit and flare dress because you can't really tell that the flare is because you've got a baby bump and not just the way that the dress, uh, the skirt portion of the dress flares out. I really like this, it's a nice easy option. Dresses work in most offices um, and no one's going to look at you strangely like you're suddenly changing what you wear. Whereas if you have to buy more flowy tops um, or you start adding on blazers or scarves it can look a little odd if you don't normally do those things. You'll notice that everything I showed today had a print on it. I find that the printed stuff helps because it kind of helps disguise the tummy region and doesn't really draw attention to it like a normal plain block colour would. But I hope that these tips came in helpful um, and that with, by me sharing some of the things that worked for me, they can give you some inspiration and some ideas for things that will work in your office to hide the baby bump. And congratulations on your pregnancy! Thanks for watching.